Hey guys, Seven WWE Rocks here, and the big wrestling talk I feel like right now is PWG. It's on fire. They are announcing events in advance. They're announcing the matches in advance. They've announced the entire Battle of Los Angeles, you know, roster, entrance, whatever, all 24 wrestlers, and uh, that's what this video is going to be talking about. So I'm going to be going through the list, and uh, as I go through it, I'm going to be saying, you know, what I like about this guy, maybe a future match that hopefully happens at Bola, and uh, we'll just go from there. But before I get into that, I'd also like to talk about Tremendous Four is happening. It's the next PWG event, and uh, it has been announced that. Jeez, my lights flickered. Sorry about that. Um, it has been announced. Uh, hold on, let me. Spoiler, if. Uh, jeez, my light keeps going out. I don't know what's happening. Uh, Mystery Vortex spoiler. If you don't want to hear it, you know, just skip ahead in the video or just pause it for the next 10 to 30 seconds. But basically, Anne Helico and Jack Evans will verse the Young Bucks at Three Men Dis Four. I don't know if it's for the titles. If you didn't know or you didn't want to be spoiled, it the Young Bucks did win the championships at Mystery Vortex. So I don't know if that match is going to be for the tag titles, but it sounds freaking awesome. I'm so happy Anne Helico is in PWG. And I am so happy Jack Evans is back in PWG. So that should be a really, really good match that I can't wait for. But let's get into the 24 Battle of Los Angeles uh, entrance. So first three guys I am not familiar with. So if I do uh, mispronounce their name, I apologize. And uh, I'm sure somebody will correct it. Hopefully kindly you correct it. I mean, a lot of people, they're pretty they're pretty hurtful when I mispronounce names. Uh, not pointing any fingers, Charles. But basically... Um, the first three guys I don't know, and people were very kind to send me uh, match links of their best stuff, and uh, I really do appreciate it, but I'm probably not going to watch those matches because I want to just see them at BOLA, see them for the first time without saying, uh, you know, oh, I already like this guy, oh, I already don't like this guy. I just want to see what they do at BOLA and judge them f there. So, first guy that was announced was Will Osprey, Osprey, I don't know how do you pronounce that, but... Uh, a lot of people say, oh, everybody in this is good, so it doesn't really matter. But Marty Skrull, Skrull, I guess, was next. Squirrel, I don't know. Marty Skrull. Timmy, Timothy Thatcher is number three. I don't know who that is, but I hear all three of these guys are awesome. So I just love PWG for introducing new talent where I can see these guys from all around the world and be like, dang, these guys are awesome that I've never heard of. So I think that's something PWG does so perfect. Number four, Mike Bailey, Speedball Mike Bailey. I love him. Five, Chris Hero. Always got to have Chris Hero. He's our hero. Six, Biff Busick. That will be really good. Seven, Mark Andrews or Mandrews from TNA. Uh, we don't see much of him at TNA, so I really hope we see something really good from him at PWG. I think he'll really blow us away. Eight, Brian Cage, the FN machine. You got to have him. Nine, Ricochet. Ten, Tommy End. I'm glad he's back in it. Eleven, Trevor Lee. My pick to win it, to be honest. 12, Pentagon Jr., that is insane. Uh, 13, Drew Gulak, that will be really good. 14, and Helico. 15, Trent, the man returns. But no uh, Chuck Taylor, so that's really disappointing. 16, Andrew Everett, freaking love that. 17, Phoenix, that's going to be really good. 18, Rich Swan, always a classic one, I love it. 19, Jack Evans, that will be really awesome. 20, Drago, freaking killing it in Lucha Underground. 21, Matt Seidel. 22, Aerostar, 23, the technic technical wizard, Zack Sabre Jr., and 24, Drew Galloway. So, a lot of interesting guys. A lot of Lucha Underground guys, which I really love. I think they'll do really good in it. TNA guys, you got Mandrews and Drew Galloway. I'm excited to see what they do with it, because right now, Mandrews hasn't really done that much, and Drew Galloway is more in the rising, so he hasn't done many singles matches. So, I'm excited for that. I don't. I actually don't want to see Lucha Underground guys verse each other because we've seen that so much in Lucha Underground. I want them to verse like, uh, you know, freaking Timothy Thatcher, or, you know, Tommy N, Trevor Lee. I would love to see those guys involved with Lucha Underground guys. So exciting event! All twenty-four guys have been announced, as I said, and uh, it's in August, like always. That should be really good. Sorry, got a text, but uh, let me know your thoughts on the whole, you know, roster, the entrance, whatever. And uh, it should be a really good event, and uh, I was going to name off some matches, but uh, I think this video is too long to begin with. So let me know what you would want to see at BOLA in the matches, and I'd love to hear that. So thank you so much for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, all the good stuff. Follow me on Twitter at 7 WWE Rocks. If you're watching Slammiversary tonight, enjoy it. I hope it's a great night of wrestling. And uh, thank you so much for watching. As always, have a nice day.